and the rest of this fabulous Orioles team searching for a three-game sweep of the Miami. Dela Cruz, Myers, and Soler in the outfield left to right. Your double play combination, Joey Wendell, Luis. Who's two. Today they'll face Kyle Bradish looking to start the second half strong after a terrific ERA. That's how good Kyle Bradish has been as of late. Starts this game. Tarp briefly on the field before the game, but removed after just a sprinkling of rain. Plate appearances he reaches. And a rare, not full swing and a miss, but at least a And he has not gone down in any one of those two strike counts as he fouls. Bradish goes away again. Yes. See, that's that's just in his that's his sprays that one out of play. Bradish continues to go down of anybody in baseball. Another pitch down and away. That was the changeup at 93. And we'll go to the fastball, and it's knocked out of the mitt. Six straight foul balls and a rise makes it seven. Bone. He swings and misses. Swinging strike and a strikeout. That is only his 20th strikeout in Solaire, who takes the game's first breaking ball for a strike. It's contact about 94% of the time he swings. And that backdoor slider or front door scouts. Austin Hayes on his t shirt day on any kind of fastball. 61 strikeouts. On breaking balls between outs and a double play Friday. Hits one off the fist right back to Bradish. Good first inning for yesterday. Marlins go with an opener today. It's Steven Okert who throws. Batter, punched out three. And expected to probably be in there just for one inning after working one in the third. Now so it's an interesting move in the third game. Looking on there. He's just smacked one up the gap. Opener Ganderson with a double. This, and he quickly gets out of the box as the ball's out in right center field. Solaire and Meyer. Two plate appearances. And we heard Tony Mancinino before the game say to Adley Rutschman, you can't let Gunner. And Rutschman takes strike one. Peace, second and walks. Ryan Noda for walks. Season. Field well struck. And one hop. A How about that? I love that. Gotta love that. Not much work needed there in the third base coach's box. Adley Rutschman. Matt. Ostrock at oh, the God. wall. Run, bullpen, black. Hey, now. Osby pitch. Anthony went down. And Carhart rather thrilled about it. Oriole. He knew he wasn't going to be shut out on his team. So four for four. Who's in an 0-2 hole? And it's a slider coming in that saw the league hitting this afternoon. And you gotta wonder, I mean, look, everybody says, well, you're just an opener, it's just what it typically is for him. Yeah, yeah, that slider works. Opponent's batting average coming in this game. How about 158 is what mm -hmm. opponents are hitting off of him? For strikeout rate. Up to Segura. And there's the Fermon Rias. Popped it up. Joey Wendell's there, and Soriano has an out on a pitch. Popping up against some innings limits already. Yuri Perez, who's been harder till Monday. They will likely activate Edward Cabrera off the aisle for this team, you know, and walk a lot of guys, and they strike out a bunch. A home run from Anthony, doubles from Adley and Gunner. Kyle Bradish number for Tony in that first inning. And a 1 1 count on the Marlins cleanup hitter Yuli Gurias. Last time out against the Yankees, a 14 to 1 Oriole win. And it can be. Yeah, I always look at running the baseball. Hey, he's Cowles and Santander. You know, that's how you can know her a lot of balls. Right? Right? I kind of like close games the 10 spot later on. <laughs> Gurriel Maxwell. Junior at, at, at Auburn University. Brian De La Cruz, that ball drifting into right center. League. As a pitcher. As a pitcher, when you have, when you know you have the defense behind you, does that change the way? Made me feel better, right? Because I knew I kept on the ground in his direction. He was going to make a play, and it means a lot. You don't have to strike. Thirty-four years providing homeless men with food, housing, clinical team that has been baseball's best over the past decade, and leads the National League one later today. Ball on a strike, George Soriano to G last six. That's going to be a terrific.
for the Orioles tomorrow. Brandon Hyde announced before today's game that Grayson McCann swings through a slider and Soriano has those are trying to win if it was three or four years ago Grayson would have never been sent down and you know he'd have got his starts in this year at the RA since going down at Triple-A Henderson a ground ball to Gurriel and that is a one terrific coaching staff three nothing lead is Joey Wendell goes the other way foul again all right so there's a piece that that seems like a lot twelve fifteen dollars per baseball And that baseball will get thrown right back to Kyle after strike two. It's gone. You served your purpose. <laughs> All right, that ball's that in ball's the dirt. The ground. It's gone. James Mc... Stallings flails at a slider. Strikeout number two for Kyle Bradish. Dane Myers, number nine hitter, takes but an RBI at the plate. Kyle Bradish looking to continue. Last time he allowed multiple home runs in a game. Kyle Bradish on the breaking balls. So his slider spins about 2,631 RP. That fastball fades to Myers. Hayes in left, and Arise is retired for the second. Got to be extra careful. Not hit many. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Right, the, the fastball's got a natural cut to it. Of course, the curveball and the slider both going right to left. Three, two. He didn't make a mistake. So they're not ready for the time with Birdland members before the game. If you're thinking about becoming right now to go out there, Ben and Devo and I, and uh, really cool. Yeah, it was a good time out there. They're so friendly. It was so nice to see everybody to be face to face. With Soriano in back of the opener, Stephen Oker. I will say my favorite moment from. <laughs> and so, you know, I was temporarily Jim Palmer. <laughs> his first at bat. Extended his on base streak to 13, extended his hit streak to him. So, if we could change up from George to shallow center, Joey Wendell's on the case. Experience story out of the minors. Started a little bit less than half his game. In the first. Cedric Mullins day to day with Brandon said he feels like the team got lucky with that all team and he had been pitching so well before getting hurt mm -hmm. ready for a 3-2 better field Myers has a beat on it George Soriano